So we saw the design lab was making a custom sign for their space on the upstairs floor. So we're going to do the same thing, except for ours can be made out of solid pieces of metal and other materials in a makerspace. So today we're going to take this one inch thick piece of uh, aluminum and turn it into a letter. Okay, once we have a uh, face off material, we're gonna go over to our second tour mop. This has our Saunders uh, fixture table. Because this is such a big part, we're gonna be pushing the limits of the machine. We're actually gonna use two Kirk vices with reversed uh, Mighty Bike jaws to hold on to it. So now we're gonna have to set all that up. So for the design of the P, I was really interested in aerospace isogrid, so that's what we use to kind of create the shape of the P. For our first operation, we're going to use a face mill to face the material off. For our second operation, we're, do, we're using adaptive clearing to pocket out all the little hexagon pieces using an 8mm end roll. Then we'll be doing another adaptive clearing to get rid of all the excess around the pea and actually make the shape. Next, we'll be doing a chamfer uh, to chamfer all of the edges that are exposed. And then we'll be drilling uh, and tapping our holes that we've made.
Okay, so now we have finished off one. We got a really awesome looking part. We uh, bandsawed the excess off. We made a spacer block, and we're gonna use the same dual vise system to hold the part upside down to do op two, which is simply gonna be facing off the excess material.